Oh, I have to tell you, George, I am pretty excited. I've never been to a clown school before. Oh, just think. We get to see Pepe El Loco, the world's greatest clown performer. The elevator left without him. George decided he should take the stairs. The messenger clown dropped his bag and his hat and nose. Maybe the messenger clown was going to Pepe El Loco's show too. George could give them back to him. It's a long, long way away. Using his numbered fingers, all George had to do was count down from floor eight to floor four. <laughs> Seven. Six. Five. Four. At least he hoped it was four. His counting system worked. Ah, here we go. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're here. Hey, your next pickup's on the 10th floor. No need to start at one. George's fingers told him exactly how to count from four to 10. George was on the 10th floor, but his delivery was practically on 10 and a half. Take everything to the first floor quickly. Pepe El Loco will be here any second. <laughs> Made it! <laughs> nice nose. Hello, my name is Pepe. Oh, is that for me? <laughs> my gadget. Oh, thank you. Now, to get to the ninth floor for my show. <laughs> You're right, the elevators are tricky. Hold this for me, will you? Can you believe how hard it is to find a parking spot at this joint? The elephants need a garage. <laughs> eh? What floor are we on? I was busy with my gadget and forgot to count. I was busy trying to figure out what your gadget was. I, I didn't count either. We'll have to start all over. Uh, I'll be late for my show. Oh, the seventh floor. That monkey is a genius. He certainly is. And now, introducing the world's greatest clown, Pepe El Loco, and his mystery gadget. And it was all made possible by George. A monkey you can really count on.